G'day, g'day, Tony Lander here with an update of the Black Stallion. And I've got some really sad news today, but also some really great news. First, the sad news. The Black Stallion is no longer the Black Stallion. He's the Black Gelding. Doesn't have quite the same ring, does it? It's a bit sad because he certainly was a beautiful stallion and would have turned out to be, I'm sure, an exceptional looking horse. The problem was that he was not happy anymore. He was walking all the time, stressed, agitated. Every time a horse moved anywhere near past his pen, he would get a bit wild and he would start to back up and rear and he was biting everything and had a couple of attacks and he just wasn't happy. So we made the big tough decision to have him gelded. So today is a big day big because day. Huh? For the biggie behind us, He's gone. he has a little operation today because we decided that we castrate him. Why did we decide this, Tony? We decided because not having our own property and trying to house him on someone else's property is really just not working and it's not good for him. He has no friends and people then start to build fences like this to keep him in. <laughs> so. Um, and he's really not so happy. The last couple of weeks he's got uh, decidedly more emotionally upset, I think would be the case. So for his welfare, for everyone's safety and for a nicer life, we get his little operation. And the great news is that now he's the black gilding. He's super calm, super relaxed and he's able to live with friends. And this was a big problem as a stallion. He was having to be isolated. Couldn't be living with his brothers. And now, he can. So, we'll show you a little bit about what he looks like now. So here, we'll just turn the camera around and look, here he is with his brothers. The white arrow there and the brown warm blood. Oh, he's gone back into his hut. We'll go and check out what they look like inside. So, here they are. There he is, the black gelding. Say hello to the folks. How are you? Yeah. Look, he doesn't nip, he doesn't bite anymore, and he's much happier. He even kisses instead of biting now. How cool is that? And with Ludwig, he gets on, there's no fighting, no biting. No striking, no backing up, no rearing. So cool. So it was a tough decision. Um, I'm sure it was pretty tough for him as well going through the whole process, but he lost quite a bit of weight before he got gelded because he was so stressed and agitated with everything that was going on. He lost quite a lot of weight and then after the gelding as well, it was obviously a bit stressful for him. He lost more weight, but he's putting it back on and starting to look like his old self now. So it was really a question of ego as to whether we kept him as a, a stallion because it was really all about what we wanted and what it looked like. And But we're really, really happy the decision we've made that is so much better for him because he can now be more relaxed. He can take his time. He can have his fun with his friends. He can be in the pasture with them. He can live with them at night, day. And this, in our opinion, is the most important thing, that it's better for him, not about us. Um, we cared about how he feels, how he gets on, how he lives day to day. So now together with his friends, this is a much, much, much better picture. So we're happy we made the right decision. And we'll keep posting on as we develop him and bring him on. And... Uh, Keep you updated. Okay. So it's only been just over a couple of months since he got gelded. And now he's calm, relaxed, and much more happy. So you just heard the mare whinny. Doesn't even bring his head up. Then the stallion whinnies as well on the property. Doesn't even hardly stop eating. So the calmness, the relaxedness, the easy life is coming along for him so much better. It feels so much better to have him in this 
condition of this um, calmness uh, for us it's fantastic and we just walk along no stress no hassle just looks around a little bit so for me it was the absolute right decision that we got him gelded better for him better for everybody so that's the update on the black gelding who now we just call him the black and he likes to walk along with his nose on the ground so he can eat the grass come on then and the perfect thing is now he can go out into the paddock and have a bit of a move around a full run if he wants to like like a real horse should be able to do <laughs> instead of being locked up and isolated and stressed and worried about his hormones and everything else so um, there's obviously places for stallions because how else do we get more horses but there comes a time when if we think about it from the horse's point of view which is what we tried to do it is so much better if he's no fantastic uh, breeding stallion and we're not going to produce hundreds of foals why should he have to have a life that is constantly stressed and over the top with his hormones and worrying about everything else and why can't he have a life that's relaxed calm enjoyable so the there is a saying that says a good stallion can certainly be a great gelding and that's what we believe the black will be and we'll help him come along in this way and have a good life and be able to live it in a peaceful relaxed and enjoyable way so cool okay we'll head him off to where his brothers have gone up into the next pasture and what else is cool about him right now is even though he is living with the boys now he's really really quite cool about when they walk off and they're gone he's not worried about it this is so cool and he can be on his own you can take the horses to him you can take them away from him, or you can take him to the horses and away again he's and he's really not worried and here's a couple of mares that when he used to walk by it was a real problem <laughs> he would be on his back legs whinnying carrying on and uh, now he's not so worried about it at all come on then so we'll see how he goes right here today because they're right at the fence <coughs> oh, look at that a little bit of little bit of stallion remembrance here but not too bad at all so after just a couple of months almost forgotten and it feels so much better so much safer so much emotionally better mentally better and of course it's also physically better because he's not standing on his back leg so much he's not backing up in his yard he's not yeah causing problems for himself and everyone else so super good <coughs> though he has become very interested in the grass <laughs> so we'll head down to the pasture and see what Francie's up to.